Anyways, boys, um, let's go back to the bullshit, um, a.k.a. Twitter. Let's see more of what is happening in the world. I also wanted to look up... Well, first of all, let's get this little girl off my screen, and let's um, actually see if there's any uh, new info about ACK. I mean, well, excuse me, not about ACK, about... um. Well, I know academics, he said on his Twitter page that he was going to fucking um, talk more about the situation. Like, if we... Academics... Da -da -da. Maybe his Twitter page has more information about this situation. Okay, he said, five hours ago, I have some exclusive... 6 9 news to break in the morning and sad face emoji. So he didn't upload a video on his YouTube channel yet about 6 9 21 hours ago. This one was five hours. But I mean, hey, something's going to happen. He found out something. Uh, I would love to hear more. It's such a lesson to be learned here, man. Um, I want to actually, even though I already watched the videos, I, I'm, I really want to just watch them, one at, le one at least on camera to just sort of see where, like, I guess the people's Check it out is? now. It's all over, know. people. It's all over. Now, uh, listen, ladies and gentlemen, as we look back on the career look of at this nigga. Nine, there's a lot of lessons to be learned here, okay? Uh, first and foremost, it's very important to know that a lot of times what make you successful mm. is a lot of times what brings you down. And if you don't understand <laughs> that, you probably won't understand this whole story. Nope. The people that surround you that help build the image that support you is a lot of times <sighs> continues and fuels. Okay, there's nothing else to see. I'm bored already, bro. The nigga, he goes on for eight minutes talking about, you know, the situation. And he's in a sad position because that nigga was his friend. Personally speaking, I mean, I like the music. I don't know about if I care for Takashi as a person, but I mean, I like the music. But I mean... If he did all those crimes, then yeah, sticky, fuck that nigga. Uh, come real sticky, uh. Yeah, if this nigga did all those horrible crimes, if he really did and didn't care about putting other people in jeopardy, he could have killed somebody. He could have killed, like, so many people. He could have murdered families, man. Like, you know, so it's like, yeah, put, put, that, put that animal in jail, bro. How are you going to pop off shots at a stadium during a game, bro? You, 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 you pop shots at the Barclays, nigga? I could have been there. I do videos in front of Barclays all the time, nigga. How dare you? He's a fucking mongrel, man. Like, you can't keep this dude in control and you want to fucking, you want to put out gang hits on niggas? You wanna, like, you're literally being a piece of trash for no reason, bro. You're already rich. You got to stop all that gang bullshit. But you know what? The lesson hit him late. I hope all y'all little gangster thug ass, little high school wannabe fuckboy ass niggas take this lesson in mind, bro. This is not no joke. Life ain't no game, nigga. And as soon as you fucking strike out, that's it. You don't get no second chances, bro. Takashi's life is over. It's um, over, um, nigga. Um, He's um, done. Um, He's dead. He's better off dead at this point, even though I know that's a very extreme, rigid view to have. But the nigga's probably better off dead. He's going to be in prison for the rest of his fucking life. So it's like, bro... Look at the minimum. He's facing a minimum of 25 years, man. And he's got like six different charges of that shit. You want to be a gangster, nigga? You want to be a thug? You want to see the kind of shit that this nigga was doing, bro? Give me a second here in the donations. I got, I'm talking to niggas right now because I know that I got a couple of y'all knucklehead-ass niggas inside of this chat, too. I know I got some of y'all thug-ass niggas in here, bro. I want y'all to see what the fuck happens, man. Because this shit doesn't go nowhere but hell, nigga. He's facing six counts, including shooting a gun during a crime. Charged with conspiracy to commit robbery, shootings, and he surrendered his passport and bank balance, 1.5 milli. The federal gov the feds, they said, yo, we're going to work with our partners to ensure that 6 9 and his fucking crew are in a place where they will never be able to hurt or violence anybody on our communities again. And according to the feds, the nine trade gangster bloods, including 6 9 sold drugs such as heroin, fentanyl, fu I can't even read this one, Furin furanil. Fenton, furanil fentanyl, M MDMA, detolubiline, and marijuana. Like, what the fuck was this nigga doing? Bro, so this nigga lived the ultimate life in terms of cooking dope, um, you know, pushing weight, gang hits, racketeering, mob shit, gang gang shit. Look what the fuck it landed, this nigga. He's done, bro. End of the road, nigga. Federal agents reported that on... And you know what's crazier? You want to know there's another element to the story. Uh, Give me a second. Sticky, uh. Give me a second, bro. I'm, a, I'm, a I'm sorry. I'm going to read the donations. But uh, give me a second. You know what's crazy? He was going to be killed. There was a hit on his head. He fired a couple of old associates, apparently. People he used to work with. And they got pissed the fuck off and decided that, you know what? We're going to kill this nigga. So they went. They were going to meet him at, like, this casino he was supposed to be at. And they were going to kill him. The feds, the feds literally went to his house the day before they arrested him and they were like, yo, 6 9 
you're Nick, you're gonna get killed, nigga. You're about to die tomorrow. And then he was like, no, I'm good. His former associates wanted to super violate him, which a prosecutor defined as a violent act, including shoot him. I love how he said including, not just shoot him. Super violate means da 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 and shoot him. Like, <laughs> nigga, this not they were gonna torture this nigga. What the fuck was 6ix9ine looking forward to? So you know what? Maybe it's better that he's going to be in jail for the rest of his life. He'll be safe in there to get his um, anus penetrated from here to kingdom come, bro. I know I'm going to have a lot of people that, you know, are mad at me. But, like, he committed. if he committed these crimes, you shouldn't be vouching for him. He's a monster. You know what I mean? Anyways, super violate, ultra violate, man, whatever the fuck they're going to do, he's going to have a real loose asshole by the time he... How long do you... He's just, he, like, hold on a second. Let's, let's look this up real quick, bro. Let's look this up real quick. Six, nine... Heights. How tall is he? Okay, I looked at this before. Five feet six inches. Oh lord! Oh, oh lord! I know with the rainbow hair. Oh, he! Oh, 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 oh! I damn! I almost feel it for him. These niggas are—they're going to town. They're going six nine on six nine, bro. Oh shit! Oh, penis sticky, uh, come real sticky, uh, oh no, it's gonna be a bloodbath, bro, it's, uh, all right, <laughs> Mrs. 6 9 it's been an, <laughs> oh my god, that's crazy, bro, that's crazy, I'm gonna say the N, <laughs> someone said I'm gonna say the N word, god damn, bro, I mean, I feel, I feel kind of bad for him, I feel kind of bad for him, he's gonna be having his stomach tied up in knots on the daily, He's a young dude. It's like, you know, you can't not feel bad knowing that a young guy who I was his age once, all of, a lot of you are his age right now, and he, he did this to himself. He has no one else to blame, bro. He was advised by so many people, and it's like, hey, Mrs. Obama, get down. Status, alive. Damn, I don't know, unless he beats the case. If he didn't do these crimes, here's the thing. If he didn't do these crimes, if he's not guilty, then fuck, man, I... I I want him to beat the case if he's not guilty. But if he's guilty of all this shit, then I mean, yeah. Either way, I know the system can be biased, man. So let's just wait it out. More details will come to light. And we'll see what the fuck happens. But as it's looking right now, bro, him and federal prison, bro, is not looking like the best fucking combo, man. I mean, he eviscerated, <laughs> he eviscerated himself. I didn't eviscerate nothing. He did this shit. Anyways, we have donations coming in. I did not get a chance.